hello! Today I'm here with a new video and if you're wondering about the sound, I finally bought a microphone. So I really hope the sound is good now. I have been sitting here and mixed some with the settings. I got two comments about... I have hair in my mouth. Um, on video I... that my sound was very low and I know because when I got my new camera, okay, I don't take this in this one. I have a microphone now. Check. <laughs> so, today it is the second day in my Nabla week and I am using the Soul Blooming palette today. I'm going to take first one new palette, then one old palette, new palette, old palette, new palette. Yeah, yeah. I hope <laughs> you get what I mean. So, today it is the Soul Blooming and I have done a free looks one palette with this, I think. This contains 12 shades. And I don't use this palette, like, at all. I think it's a really nice palette, actually, and the colors are really good. So, today we are using this, or I am using this, and I am doing a palette bingo with order rules. I am thinking about doing all the old palettes, um, a palette bingo with them. Uh, I am not super decided on that one, but that. But I think it's going to be like that. So yeah, we're going to start with Soul Blooming. I'm going to random.org and I am at random.org. Can you see this? I hope. So I will start and... The f Did I say I was going to do this with order rules? I think. And Jessica... Uh, usually do this and I love them. I have done two. One that went very very good and one that went like shit. So okay, I'm going to generate the first one and this is going in my crease. Number one. And fuck my life I think. Like what is this? Number one. It's honey drip. This is like a duochrome and or another like it's like a topper shade. If you have seen my palette bingo with my lovely lovely palette Moonspell. You know. You know the drill if we say like that. I'm just going to find my things. How is this even possible? How? Okay, so I'm going in with 100 drip in my crease. And does this stick in the crease? No, it's... No, it does not. No, it does not do that. <laughs> Maybe I need like a stiffer brush, but at the same time, I like this shade, but not in my crease. So, okay, second shade that is going on my outer V is number one again, number three. And number three in this palette is this one that is going on my outer half of my outer V. I can promise you that I'm going to have 12 like in my inner corner and it's going to be on this one. This I usually use in my crease. This will uh, maybe not show up at all. Why do I keep doing this? It feels like me and Marlin. Um, I can leave her down as well. I'm going to leave Jessica down in the description. I can leave Marlin as well. Uh, when she, Jessica and Linda has done their collab series, Marlin didn't have any luck, like, at all when they did palette bingos and I feel you, Marlin. I really do. This doesn't look good at all. 
Okay, so now we're going into the inner corner and pray for me. Seven. It's this climbing rose. Oh, maybe not like super, super bad, but not good. Okay, so climbing rose. And how is this going to look? I think like shit. It's, it's going to look like I have put on eyeshadow on half of my lid, I think. And only half of my lid. So maybe I should try to like do... Like this is supposed to look like this. <laughs> Can I see it a little bit? And like try to take this like a little bit in my crease just like over like this. I don't think mascara can save me. Okay, so I'm happy though that I got climbing rose because I think that was like the best thing that could happen. So, okay, I will try to get honey drip out of my face and then fix my base and my brows and then I come back and then we have the under eyes and inner corner left and also I think I'm going to <laughs> draw a sixth shade where I can put wherever I want because I want to do this a little bit darker. So, okay, I will fix my base and my brows and then I'll come back. So, I'm going back and now we are doing the under eyes and <laughs> when I like, did my base, this isn't such a bad look yet. I think it's like doable. Um, so, we will see. I just hope for something okay if i tell the gods what i want the palette god i want four i'm gonna see if that helps so let's do it one i have already had it booyah four okay okay so this maybe works because four is bolero bolero and i think this can go pretty good with this look. It is like the matte version of Rose, Climbing Rose, if I'm not mistaken. So, but I still have the inner corner left and I hope for 11. So I'm taking Bolero under my eye and I actually, if I would stop now, this would work. I don't know though because it's nothing here and then things there but okay. This far is good. So now I hope for 11. Because now we are doing the inner corner. Okay, control myself. Did you see that? Did you see? Did you see? Because number 11 is philosophy. Maybe I need to swatch this. I don't know. I don't think so. Okay, so I am going to take philosophy in my inner corner. And I am not going to take a sixth shade because this. I like this palette bingo thing again. And I don't want to take a sixth shade because I don't think anything. I think if I take a sixth shade, it will only make it worse. So I'm going to put on mascara and something on my lips and something in my waterline and then I come back with the finished look and I'm so much happier now than I was like 10 minutes ago. So yeah, I will 
and fix a lot of things and then I come back. Okay, so I am back. And for my waterline I used Honey Dude from Colourpop and for my lips I used Little Things from Colourpop that is a lipstick and I think this turned out better than I thought it was going to do um, when I started because I think this this looks like a normal look or like a look that I could have done. The only thing, the honey drip isn't that like visible, it's just like a little shimmer up here. But other than that, this totally works. I think I like it, even though it's pretty light. I don't normally do these light looks. But yeah, I have nothing against this. So I'm still going to do palette bingo with order rules. So for this palette bingo I got Honey Drip in my crease. Chamomile, I think it's pronounced. On my outer half of my lid, or in my outer V, I always do like half of my lid. On my inner lid I got Climbing Rose, under my eyes I got Bolero, and in my inner corner I got Philosophy. So, I actually like this look, even though it's not maybe a typical me look, but I didn't think it would go this good. So yeah, I really hope you like this palette, this palette, this video. So that was my palette being with order rules with the soul blooming from Nabla and I I like this palette. I said it in the beginning, I think. I am a little bit lost in the head. But yeah, I like the packaging. I love that Nabla has sturdy, not bulky, but like sturdy cardboard palettes. I really like that. And I think this is vegan, this palette. And I don't know, it's not my favorite front of it, but I think the front of the palette and the inside, they, <laughs> it looks good. And I have used all of these shades at least once and this palette is really good. And I, if you like this color story, try this palette because I think you're going to like it because it is a good palette and I love that Nabla has mirrors. Oh, there is me. And there is you somewhere. <laughs> I love that Nabla has mirrors in their palettes. And yeah, that was all for this video. I really hope that you will like this Nabla week. Tomorrow it is a first impression again. And should I tell you? No, but it's a first impression tomorrow. So yeah, I really hope I see you then. And if you're not subscribed to my channel, please do so you don't miss any of my videos. And I hope I'll see you in the next one. Bye.